Welcome to InterGeo TV here at InterGeo 2018 in Frankfurt. Joining me now is Eduardo Falcon, Vice President, Executive Vice President, General Manager of Topcon Positioning Group worldwide. Nice to see you again here in our studio. Welcome to Frankfurt. Nice to see you again. That's nice every so year. We have to discuss a couple of topics sure. of the industry and especially about Topcom. First of all, can you describe the current pressures on infrastructure across Europe? It for sure. Um, you know, ultimately, the, the, everything that is happening in Europe, uh, it, there is an expansion on, uh, on, uh, on the data management uh, in everything that is uh, related to uh, infrastructure and technology. In, in Topcon, we define that as the intersection of infrastructure and technology uh, event. And um, in, in Europe particularly, what we are uh, uh, finding and, and fighting actually is uh, an aging infrastructure. Uh, we need to, uh, to work on that. I mean, every country is investing heavily into that. And of course, for the industry, it's a, it's a great, uh, great market for us to expand. So ultimately, we are expanding all the customer base as we move forward in Europe. So what measures do you think need to be implemented to help meet this demand? I think that we are working uh, as manufacturers in expanding everything that's related to data management and uh, data automation, actually, on the field and in the neighboring areas. So it is critical that we, we have uh, an integration of sensors, right? And uh, we are working hard on that. Uh, the answer for, uh, for actually budgets that are shrinking is the increase of technology and the development of new technology that can allow us to do more with less, actually be more productive. That's actually the key for Topcon. Can you tell us about any big infrastructure projects Topcon is working on? Sure. We, we work, uh, actually we sell products to customers that are working in major projects uh, globally. Um, examples of those are the Grand Paris uh, Metro, uh, these are four lines that are being extended until the year 2030. And uh, Topcon is there uh, doing monitoring, actually, all the monitoring system. Same thing, the, the LA uh, s metro, same, same uh, issue or same, same type of technology. We just started working with them for the monitoring side of it. So, uh, again, monitoring uh, the infrastructure that are being created or the ones that are being maintained are critical for this uh, at this stage uh, in, in the way that the, the infrastructure is developing worldwide. Do you expect to see the adoption of emerging technologies for the development of new infrastructure? Sure, so today again, it's a mix of, of sensors that are uh, taking place and, and actually the products uh, that before were uh, uh, Part of the desktop solutions for us are migrating into the into the instruments. Uh, really, what we are uh, seeing is a motion, not only to uh, improve workflows and uh, manage data, but also to uh, to do quality control in real time. That is uh, is key, actually, for the kind of development that we are doing today, and the ones that are going to be uh, part of this uh, central part of the industry as we move forward. One more question: You are operating worldwide. You are responsible looking to the States on the one hand and Europe on the other hand and the other parts of the world. How is the market growing? Different ways? The market in general have uh, grown for us. I mean, our market share have grown dramatically last year. Um, different, uh, we more than doubled, almost tripled actually, the industry uh, size uh, for, for uh, the development last year. But again, the market is a solid market in, in all China, Asia. In general, Topcon and Sokia are very strong. Uh, Europe is developing its any market share uh, quickly, and uh, that's one of the reasons why our expansion uh, on global basis. And America is solid. Uh, it it has been actually increasing as mm, steady growth, actually, in the last two, three years. Uh, so, you know, we are enjoying a good uh, many years of, of development. Uh, in general, because uh, I think that is key, this issue of the infrastructure uh, intersecting the technology. You know, you need to be able to uh, create more productivity, and that is something that cannot be avoided. Other markets like Latin America, we are very strong there. Um, lots of changes also because uh, all the situations, uh, fights against corruption and so forth, that create actually more need for, uh, for 
better workflows and more efficiency, uh, people need to compete uh, more aggressively for the contract. So that's uh, really we are seeing a healthy uh, situation on, on global basis. So enjoy Intergeo at Frankfurt, which is hopefully a good place for you. <laughs> Great, thank you very much, thank you.